Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factoring quadratic expressions. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 4x to the third, plus 43x squared, plus 30x, and we need to factor this completely. First thing I notice is that there's an extra x in each part here, so we can pull that out. Pulling that out, we have x times 4x squared, plus 43x, plus 30, and there we have it. Well, we now have a quadratic in the parentheses, and we can factor that. Our a value is 4, and 4 is either a combination of 1 times 4, or 2 times 2. Our c value is 30, and that can either be, well, 1 times 30, 2 times 15, 3 times 10, or 5 times 6. And what I'm looking at here is I want to take one of the pairs from A, multiply by one of the pairs from C, add it to one of the pairs by A, to, uh, add it to one of the pairs by C. And we want to try to get our B value, which is 43. So instead of testing every possible one, I try to make an educated guess and try to get something that's close to 43. Well, 4 times 10 is going to be 40. That's pretty close. So let's go deal with these pairs here. This one and this one. So 4 times 10, well, that's equal to 40. Then the other pair would be 1 times a 3, and that's equal to 3. We add them together, and we actually get 43. So right off that first guess, we got it. We got a 43. We got our two pairs here. So how do we write this out? Well, x has to be here, and we still have to write it in a factored form. Let's put 1x here, and then this will be a 4x. Well, we said 4 had to be multiplied by the 10. So to do that, we have to put the 10 on this side. The 1 gets multiplied by a 3, and we put the 3 on that side. And now we actually have our answer in factored form. So here's our final answer. x times x plus 10 times 4x plus 3. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.